It's assuming there's gonna be mini video uh, blah, 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 mini games. Blah, 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 oh, I'm already, I haven't even. I barely even started. I'm already having a stroke. Hi everyone. <laughs> Is that last loud notification pop up? Wait, are your notifications broken? Are my notifications broken? Or did I do something? Hi Raymond, Tiberian, Ezekiel, Berserker, Gristar, Warren. Hello, good to see you. Yeah, I was gonna start like at like 5.30 instead because I had the time, but for some reason YouTube won't let me change anything on my videos right now. Like any stream, any just I don't know what's going on. I tried on both of my computers and it just like the edit button just doesn't work. So boo. <laughs> you got boo. <laughs> I'm here. Um must be my phone. Uh, I, I mean, I'm just assuming it's YouTube. Uh, nothing usually works correctly on YouTube, to be fair, at this point. I've just accepted life as pain. <laughs> Who are you? I ask myself that every day in the mirror, Mossy. I have no answer. I'm hoping you'll tell me. Why are you early? Why are you listening? <laughs> nah, uh... I'm early because I had the time. I was going to start actually a bit ago, but my YouTube wasn't letting me change the, the um, schedule time for some reason. I tried on multiple computers. So I just said, screw it. I'm going to press start. Nothing can stop me from pressing start still. So I'm here. Soulless ginger. Well, that's just a fact. That's just, that's just a fact. You know, you can't really, dude, that's just something you can't really deny at all. As it's right in front of you. Ow! <laughs> why the bike? Why, why do you start with the bike? Out of all things, you could have thrown, I don't know, an apple. Apple, a pineapple, apple pen. You know, you could have thrown a gummy worm. Oh, you gotta throw the whole bike. Hi, Crumpets. Good to see you. Um, yeah, so... Interesting things going on. Life is still very busy, uh, but with... The current time of the year, work's starting to slow down a little bit. Uh, so I'm probably going to be getting home an hour or so earlier. Maybe even, you know, depends on how things go. Uh, so we might be able to do A, longer streams, or B, uh, um, sooner streams. I don't know which way I want to take it yet, but I'll figure that out as I go. Uh, probably won't be until... I don't know, like two weeks out or so that things will probably change. But it's looking like I'll have some more free time to hang out with you guys soon. So that's exciting. As long as nothing else explodes. You know, my internet doesn't explode. Uh, YouTube doesn't explode. Right now, uh, we are probably going to have another rainstorm. It's getting really cloudy. It's very windy outside. So who knows what's going to happen. Forever single too. That's fact. <laughs> that's fact. I ain't got time for that. Uh, yes, more me. You just had to jinx it. I know. It's something I always do. Hi, Greed. Good to see you. Uh, but yeah. Hopefully, things are looking up to being able to hang out with you guys more. Have some more free time. Um, it's just, uh, we're, my work's starting to slow down a little bit. So, you know. They gotta make cuts when things start slowing down. And I'm no exception, no matter how good of the job you are. I've been having a cold start to spring. Is it still uh, like lower in temperature over there? Ow, snowing? Ow. I missed, didn't know I could miss. Maybe you gotta get good. You guys always tell me to get good. It's your turn to get good. Upper 40s, wow. It's already, um, here, let me, it's already in the 70s for me. Right now, looking at uh, my temperature, it's 75 degrees out, but very windy, very windy though. You wouldn't believe it with the wind. But you would believe everything else being knocked over outside. I am. Hi, Nightmare. Good to see you. Rainstorm and wind over her. Over her. So it's hitting you too. Can you, like, keep it over there? I would prefer Thor to not, like, make a path of destruction to where I don't get to stream and hang out and play video games. That would be great. Um, Can you just, like... You know, go outside, make a small sacrifice, contact him, um, you know, and, and, and then make, you know, keep him over there. <laughs> That'd be great. I don't have, 
I do not have very good standings with Thor these days. He just does not like me. I haven't talked to him in maybe a year. He's really going after stuff around my place. I don't know what I did wrong. But apparently he's got a grudge. I got a lot of snow earlier in the week. I wish I got snow. I wish I did something this winter or had the time to like go up into the mountains and go like snowboarding or something. I haven't seen snow since I woke up. Actually, that's not true. I We've had snow fall, but we haven't had snow snow stick. So I want to see snow that sticks and I could play in it. Uh, given I have the warmest room in the house. Hey, that's not too, ba uh, too bad, uh, Raymond. My room sucks. I've talked about it before, but where my, my office is back to back to my, uh, my, my bedroom, both of them have a giant window that has a direct sunlight in the afternoons, like at like, uh, 4 PM ish or something. It's just direct. So my room also gets very, very warm, especially in the summer. Uh, it's been very windy here where I live. It's not too different from where my apartment was. So it's weird. Hmm. Maybe altitude or something? I haven't been weaving any really strong windstorms the last couple of months. Just sometimes they just hit. I'm losing a lot of stuff outside too. We've lost chairs. Like, and I get scared that my grill's going to get knocked over. I got a brand new grill like six months ago or whatever. And I don't want to lose it. <laughs> go north? If it were that easy, Mossy, I would go north. I doubt that Thor has weather jurisdictions in the U.S. Maybe you should report him for it. Oh, that might be one way to get back at him. Oh, Berserker, you might, you might be right. That might be, that might be it. <laughs> that might be how we finally get back at him. Because he's always starting fights with me. He's he shuts down my power. He shuts down my internet. He uh, just uh, makes rainstorms, floods the roads, scares my dogs. I feel like it's very targeted. Taking the girl to Oz. Imagining me with golden teeth? Golden teeth? That sounds painful. Or is it just like the, the stuff you put on top of your teeth? That's the question. Your grill. Oh! That's not right. I gotta remember you guys are hip and with, with stuff. I'm not. <laughs> Went completely over my head. All right, I'm gonna boot up the video game while uh while I continue to make uh, a fool of myself. I'm not. I'm afraid we're not in Iceland anymore. I wish I was. I wanna. I wanna go back so bad. Place is so pretty. All right, let me get the game rolling here. Hopefully nothing breaks. Yet? Hopefully, maybe, sometime. Chapter six, the Yakuza way. Yakuza. So fun to say. Yakuza. <laughs> I'm sorry, just loading into this game, seeing Kiryu squared up, staring at a wall was pretty fun. What'd you say to me? What'd you say about my wife? <laughs> I for my lunch 12 eggs and one pound of beef. Can you share? I had pretzels and hummus. <laughs> no no meat in, in the area. The last time we figured out how to do uh, be a real estate agent, I guess. Um, I don't know if I'll... Should I remember to do that more? Hey, do you guys want to fight? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Oh, I feel like it looked kind of complicated. It probably isn't too bad since we did the side quest. Oh, spin. That gave us some, uh, some help. Oh. Mm, I love violence. Oh, give me the bike. Beast mode, beast mode. Yeah, beast mode, baby. I'm spinning. My bike. No, I wanted to kill him. There we go. Ooh. No spoilers. That is correct. 
I'll pin that once I'm out of this fight. Oh no, he, he sidestepped me. Okay, mid swing, you can't really. Uh, oh, that like freezes time for a while. You could probably dodge stuff by stand switching. That's kind of cool. All right, let me uh, let me let me pin that. Really quick. Pin that. Look at that, gamers. There are mini games on the main menu. Wait, on the main menu there are mini games. Oh wait, I saw that we could go into like boss rushes and stuff. I didn't know if there were other mini games. Hi, redacted. How to unlock last tier of it's i need to know how to do it to get the last tier of upgrade huh? also big man <gasps> gambling it's the dream machine yes take my money oh i get fighters binding Ooh, i wonder if that's an upgrade so where was uh it's this this is where we were right I'm assuming it works like the tiger and dragon chop where we need to do something and then stuff will get moved forward in time, right? I don't think I can do anything. Why is there a child here? A kid all by himself? It's not safe here. Wow, I, I walked past the side quest. Oi. Hey, this is no place for a kid all alone. It's not safe. Go home to your mom. I don't want to. I don't like my mom when she's mad. What? Your mom got angry with you? Yup. I wanted to buy something for the super cool vending machine, but she flipped out. Super cool vending machine? Not like the this one here? What? The kid wants uh -huh. a Coca-Cola? It's nothing like that. It's a lot bigger and it lit up with these bright lights. It's really, really cool. Why did your mom get angry over that? I don't know. My mom is always really nice, but she got really, really mad at me. She looks scary. Okay. So what are you going, what are you doing here? My mom went out, so I took a train here. You came all the way by, here by yourself? That's pretty guts. I gotta hand it to you, kid. <laughs> I did a lot of chores and saved up all my allowance. Good for you. It's tough for a kid your age to save money. Uh, yep. I worked really hard to get this far, but... What's wrong? I wanted to buy something for the cool vending machine, but it's all at the back of the alley. It's dark, and it's kind of scary. A dark alley is dangerous for a kid by himself. Got it. You're right. You're smart not to go into the dark alley alone. Uh, yep. That's why I can't decide what to do. Well, I get what's holding the kid back, but does he want a soda that badly? Maybe I'll just go get it for him myself. Offer to buy it. Okay, you win. I'll go buy from this cool vending machine of yours. You be good and wait here. Deal? <laughs> You'll do that for me? Yay! Huh. Didn't expect anyone to be so happy over this. So, where is this special uh, vending machine? Uh, it's over this way. Follow me. I'm gonna get jumped. Oi. Hi, Dakama. Whoa. Rain it in, big guy. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, God. Am I getting jumped? I'm getting jumped. I'm getting jumped. <laughs> no, I don't know. What, I don't know why everybody said, oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, no. It's this one. It's here. Uh. Okay. There it is. Huh? Nani? Oh no. No! <laughs> no! 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 <laughs> I don't even start the game. <laughs> hey, your cool vending machine, is it really that one there? Uh, yeah. Is something wrong, mister? So, you, uh... This kid was looking at vending machine shilling adult merchandise. No wonder his mom flipped her lid. See, isn't it big and cool? 
There's no way I could give that junk to a kid. I hate to disappoint him, but I have to turn him down. Sorry, kid. I can't keep my promise. That vending machine is way out of your league. Go home to your mother. Uh -huh. huh? What? Tell me why. You don't need to know just yet. But I already know something about that vending machine. There's a secret magazines in it. Those magazines are covered in shrink wrap. They must be super important to be protected like that. My friend's big brother said so. The shrink wrap's not for protection. Not for the magazine anyway. You'll understand one day. understand now they say it would be really educational it's not something you need to learn now look i'm an adult but even i don't know very much it's it's deep <laughs> you see you go bite for me grown-ups always lie i'm gonna grow up to be a liar too when I was a kid, I used to think adults were unfair too. Yet yeah, here I am, just another lying grown up. <laughs> sad face. This is such a sad face from Kiryu. You. Looking up at the stars. Am I a bad person too? I denied the adult magazines from the child. Am I truly evil? Unlike a. Excuse me? What do you mean, unlike me? It's making me uh, smile as much as it did when I played it. Oh, no. It's making me laugh. <laughs> All right. A man doesn't go back on his word. I'll keep my promise and go buy your magazine. Uh -huh. Oh, you will? Uh. Of course. But you have to keep it a secret from your mom. No matter what. <laughs> Yay! You're getting my magazine. Yay! Keep it down. You want to be treated like a man, you got to be patient and quiet. Uh, yeah. Sorry, mister. And thank you so much for helping me. You shouldn't expect too much. What a dilemma. I made that kid a promise, but I can't really give that stuff to a child. What should I do? This kid is a picture of a bright-eyed innocent. I can't give him the magazine, but I can f fulfill my promise to buy it. Okay, I got this. It's too dangerous for you, so stay back. Let's do this. Is it pure soul? He's such a good boy. Uh oh. Someone's coming. Oh no. Oh. I'm exhausted. Finally, a few minutes to myself. Office workers on their break? <laughs> whisper, whisper, whisper. Hmm. hmm. Surrounded. Better back off for now. Well, how could he bring a child with him? People are so shameless these days. He's coming this way. It could be way worse. <laughs> That's true. Mm -hmm. What's uh, what's wrong, Mister? Aren't you going to buy? Well, yeah, but see, that's not it. I um. These w nosy women see me buying it. There's no telling what they'll say about it. Might have to wait them out. Oh. Hi there, President Kiryu. Hmm? Hmm? Nani? Oh, it's her. Nani? Oh, what's Marina doing here? Why here? Why now? Mister? It's nothing. Oh, girl, you're walking on that grate with those heels. She's lucky she didn't trip. What brings you out here? Oh, just 
wandering around. What are you doing here? I take my break in this park every now and then. I usually read and just relax on that bench. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, we're we're in a hurry here. Hi. Oh, of course. See you then. I'll have to back off and hope for a chance. Wait. Mm. Does he have a son? Oh, we're dealing with kids again? I have to do a stealth mission to buy sketchy magazine? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, Eki Bird, we're dealing with children. In ways I wish we weren't. Kiryu must reach the vending machine at the back of the alley without attracting attention. If he is spotted, Kiryu will become flushed and retreat to the starting point. Kiryu can choose to abandon the vending machine quest by speaking to the boy. Begin your dubious quest. Ah, I hate it. How do I see people's... Okay, I try to tell people's vision, but there's too much vision. Oh, oh, that's an invisible wall. Why are they walking like it's... They're walking around like they're in... <laughs> in Metal Gear. Oh. oh. Better back off. <laughs> oh, no, this is gonna be awful. Okay. Invisible wall. Can't walk completely that way. Okay, let her walk forward and then I'll go around. These sub stories are absolutely bonkers. I never in a million years when I was told to play this video game did I think I'm trying to get concerning magazines from a vending machine for a child. Okay, she looks this way. I go around. I don't know how to sneak past those those ladies. She's staring at the magazine. I did it! <laughs> okay, never mind, just book it. Run! Run! They don't see you running! <laughs> it's uh it's dinosaur logic. Hi silencer, good to see you! <laughs> he did it! You were able to buy a shriek rap magazine. All that's left to do is give it to the innocent lad. He's so proud of himself. He's like, yes, I got it. I did it. I got it for the job. Ah! Truly, yeah, Yakuza is a one of a kind series. That is what I've quickly learned redacted. Yay, mister, you are so cool. This is far. From cool. No way! You're my hero! Please, please, can I have it? Before I give you this, you have to promise something. Uh, sure! Uh. This is important. You can't open this magazine until you get home. Even there, you can't let your mother see it. Ever. Uh -huh. huh? Where am I supposed to read it then? You can't let anyone know about it. You can only read it when you're alone. Okay, I got it. And? There's more! This is the last thing. Don't... Kitty, you! Oh, Mossy! Oh, he's so say-so! He's such a good boy! He doesn't do anything. Oh, okay, Mossy. You liar. <laughs> Don't hide it under your bed. It's not as safe as you think. I felt that. <laughs> You're all terrible. I'm just like, that was it. I mean, 
You can do whatever you want. You can do whatever you want. I won't judge. I won't stop you. But I don't need to know. <laughs> More say so than me, you liar. Okay, I don't really get it, but it sounds pretty important. Good boy. You handed the Shriek Rack magazine to the boy. Thank you, mister. I'll treasure it forever. I, I can't wait to tell the story when I grow up about the random man who bought an unsafe so magazine for me when I was six years old. Really great memory. It's really not that valuable. There will come a day when you don't need it anymore. Just be careful getting home, okay? Yep. Thank you very much. Bible, I forget. It's not me. It's not me. Grow up strong, kid. Core memory. Oh, no. I've been spotted. It takes so much to be a man. He stares off into the moonlight. We look up and we remember. It takes so much to be a man. You made a choice. I wanted the XP. <laughs> Interesting takeaway. Yup. We're learning a lot about the way the world worked in 1980. I'm not confessing, I'm just saying, understanding exactly what he's saying. I've heard the story so many times. I guess, I guess I am too innocent. <laughs> For I have not. What XP? I don't know, I assumed I would get XP, it's a quest. I should probably run around and see if I can find some more side quests. Cause this is a new chapter. So I'm gonna run around a little bit, see what I can find. Oh, those beautiful dudes. Your collection? Your collection? Like you're some sort of hoarding dragon of unsay so material? This will make an excellent addition to my collection. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Help me. What do you want? Got a problem? Intervene. Why don't you? Why don't, oh, wait. Wrong voice. Why don't you pick on someone your own size? You mean your size? You big ol' fine by me. Okay, but I don't, you don't, you don't need to keep outing yourself, Mossy. We don't, us as a collective, don't need to know. Oh man, I got OTG because I did the dropkick. No, I want to finish. Yeah. Bunk. Why would you be surprised? I wouldn't be. I just don't want to know. I'm too busy yelling at you that I'm getting my butt kicked. Keep kicking this guy. Just keep kicking him. Kick him. Kick him. Just kick him. 360 kicks. Homing move. Alright, that's too slow. <laughs> too slow. I'm sorry, won't happen again. Thanks. I don't know what I've done with that. Please take this. I got a slightly battered ruby plate. Can I eat it? Oh, I can't go in there. So what are all the boxes in the attic? Mossy doesn't live in the attic. I, those are not mine. Those are what are you talking about? Do I need to have a talk with Niho? Niho's the only one that goes in the attic when you're when you're like not there or sleeping or whatever. Cause you know he keeps his all his stuff in there. Oh, I can do like a drop kick in between. I forgot I unlocked new moves last time we played. Oh, close line. Hey, I would like, I wanted to just finish. I just wanted to. All right, I'll hold it. That's right. I have to remember how to use it. Die. 
Or blame Niho? What do you mean? Blame Niho when I'm just, just describing what, what? Think I'm gonna let him take over my office? No. He's, he puts all his stuff in, in the attic. Who's the one that lives in the walls? That's Mossy. That's Mossy. I use the box as a card to deal when Fred comes over. Who's Fred? Did you? Did, okay. Is he at least using the sign in sheet? Because you're supposed to, whenever you enter the attic, have a, a you know, write down in the log when you came in because, uh, you know. We, we gotta be strict in my house. Oh, I, oh, he died, died. I wanted to kill him with the, the sign. The raccoon that chews on my toes at night? Oh! You know, that could be Sloopy's cousin. You should probably talk to Sloopy about that. Where's all the side quests? What does that ping mean? Does it mean I'm near something I should be looking out for? Something interactable? Ooh. Ooh. I don't see anything yet. Popcorn shop! Oh, I thought you were gonna be somebody. You were looking suspicious! Man, there's no, uh... There's no quest! I wanted to find some side quests, but I guess there might not be any? Oh, I'm stuck on a car. Uh, well, that's kind of disappointing. I wanted to get some side quests done. Hello, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Yes, hello to you, too. He what? Oh, wait, what? He was somebody? I saw somebody staring at a pool. I thought it was a broken NPC. Make some jokes. <laughs> Being is when you're close to a story location. Oh, story location. Okay. She looks so similar. No, maybe not. But still. Fred is master of poker, but does he know blackjack? I'm pretty good at blackjack. No, she's gone. Maybe it is her. But I could be wrong. What's this guy up to? Sugar daddy? Oh dear God. Is it her or not? I can't tell. Oi. Hey, what are you up to? Uh -huh. Who are you? You startled me. Who I am doesn't matter. What do you think you're doing spying on that girl? You better not be stalking her. Stalking her? Uh -huh. Oh no, 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 no. Nothing of this one. I was just keeping an eye on that girl out of a per paternal instinct. Paternal instinct? Oh, she's your daughter? Well, that's where things get murky. I can't really be sure whether she's my daughter or not. What? What do you mean? Excuse me? Got it. So you haven't seen your daughter in years. Yeah. Yes, then 15 years since my divorce, my visitation rights were denied. That's a long time. Why did you get divorced? I hate to admit it, but the business I was running back then went under. My company was doing well, nothing spectacular, but it provided a steady income. But I got complacent and failed to see the market turning. When, lo when losses started to amount, Kept plowing borrowed money into the failed business. Convinced I could turn it around. Eventually, I found myself drowning in debt. My wife must have had enough of my abstinence pride. She walked away with our daughter, not through me. I see. After that, I did anything I could to redeem myself. I took every job available and bowed before anyone who would help. Thankfully, the booming economy 
lived in my fortune. Now I earn enough money to live without any worry of one or one. Uh, good to hear. They saw me now. My wife and Atsumi might be willing to give me another chance, but I have no way to contact them. Then recently I found a girl who was a spitting image of my Natsumi when she was a child, a grown up. I see. So she's the hostess you were watching. Yes, exactly. Fifteen years ago, Natsumi was five years old. She should be around that girl's age now. If it's not too late, I want to see my girl, Natsumi, again. I want to talk with her and eat together, like we used to. I want to be called Daddy again. But the problem is, I'm not sure if she really want, really is Natsumi or not. My doubts are keeping me from taking the next step. The girl who might be your daughter is a hostess, isn't she? Why don't you just go in the club and ask her in person? If she were that is, I wouldn't be suffering like this. Whether this girl is my daughter or not, or a stranger, I need to be emotionally prepared for the follow. I cannot do anything until I know for certain. Well, you never met your daughter by doing... You'll never meet your daughter by doing nothing. I was hoping you could help with that. Can you go to her club and figure out whether she's my daughter or not? Me? me? Yeah. Is pouring your heart out and giving him a Homer Simpson voice? What about it? <laughs> Does he have that vibe? I don't know. But yeah, it's like piano sad crying music and I'm trying to give him a lisp. <laughs> yes, you understand the situation. And you took to be a man familiar with these kinds of nighttime establishments. Of course. I feel like I'm more Mr. Burns. Of course. I'll foot the blub I'll foot the club charges. Just think of it as a free night out. Hmm. Mm, well. Please, please help me see my daughter again. He's not sure if it's really even his daughter. But is he hurting? Is he willing to pay for it? Uh what should I do? Agree, because it's a side quest, and oh. I want money. Fine, I'll do it. I'll check if she's your daughter or not. <laughs> you will? Thank you so much. Uh, I'm Kiryu. Uh, Kiryu-san. My, na my name's Misumi. Thank you again for your help. Please accept this. I got 10 grand! Homer, yeah, Homer doing a Burns impression. It just comes all the way back around. The girl who looks like my daughter uses the name Reika at the club. Please use their money to request her. Uh. Okay, got it. Thank you so much for doing this. You're welcome. As long as I can at least keep half, that'd be great. I am Moss. Awesome. Uh, you're more like a tuber. Welcome! Would you like to request a particular hostess? Uh. Yeah. A girl named Reika. Reika-san, is it? Oh, Reika-san, is it? I'll let her know. <laughs> yeah, radical, bro. Two moths. Hi, Nami. Have an evening. Aw, Nami. That's okay. I'll see you next time, though. Thank you for saying hi still. I am redacted. Wow. What do you mean, wow? You, you've said so much worse things to me. <laughs> what kind, though? That's a good question. What kind would you be? Hello. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> I'm Rika. Thank you for coming today. Uh, sure. So this is a girl who might be Misumi's daughter. Close up, she does kind of resemble Misumi. She's got the round face and the little, little cheeks. Mm. I'm sorry. Have we met before? Uh. Oh, no. This is the first time. My name's Kiryu. Oh, that's a relief. Please don't scare me like that, Kiryu-san. What's a relief? I didn't remember seeing your face, Kiryu-san. I got nervous because I thought maybe I forgot a returning guest's face. It's okay. We haven't met before. Mm -hmm. But then, why did you request me? Nani. N Nani? Huh? You asked for me by name, so it must mean you knew about me, right? Where did you hear about me? Why did you request me? Hmm. She's not gonna let this go. I have to avoid making her suspicious. 
I can't tell her someone might be her father asked me to come talk to her. Why not? Why not? Why can't you just say, hey, I was just told to talk to you uh, for, for some guy. He thinks he might be your dad. Did you happen to have a dad who walked, the, um, you know, who wasn't there when you were a kid? You know, something like that. Uh, it's like family photo. You got it. Like, why not? I just really like the name Rika. The staff recommended you. I heard about you from a friend. No, the staff recommended you would be the smartest option, right? No, but friend is literal. Because then I could say that her dad is the friend. It's definitely not that one. <laughs> that one's kind of creepy. Nothing, that's true. Nothing hackers that could be that simple. Uh, the staff recommended you. I think that's like the neutral option. The staff recommended you. I asked for suggestions at the door and they told me you'd be a great choice. <laughs> oh, I see. It makes me so happy to hear. Which staffer was it? I need to thank them. Oh, uh, sorry. I'm bad with faces. Oh, that's too bad. But I'm glad the staff thinks that way about me. I'm earning recognition. I better live up to it. Good. Rick is feeling more motivated. But come to think about it, that doesn't really help me at all. <laughs> Rekka, how long have you been doing this kind of work? Um, not very long. I started it when I turned 20 this last summer. So it should be about six months. 20, huh? Misumi's daughter, Natsumi, should be around 20 years old too. Could this girl really be the uh, the one? Oh, I got a burp. Excuse me, sorry. Kiri-san, what kind of work are you in? I'm currently working in debt collection and real estate. Oh, you're quite a versatile. Speaking of real estate, I'm like, I'm thinking of moving. Maybe I can ask you for some advice. GG's, thanks. <laughs> Just be like, yo, do you have a dad that you haven't seen in 15 years? Cool, he's waiting outside. Yeah, like, well, I wouldn't be that direct. I'd be like, hey, you know, there's a guy who's looking around trying to find his daughter you seem to be in his age range um he hasn't seen her since she was about five years old i'm just trying to help a guy out um do you know his dad masumi uh his name's masumi you can reach him uh through me so if you know you know like oh yeah, there's, there's so many other ways yeah my room's too small i might be able to use this to find more out about her do you have any roommates how is your place laid out do you have a boyfriend that's creepy. Do you have any roommates? How is your place laid out? I feel like that's... Could work. Or the roommates, because roommates do take up space, obviously. Uh, that's too small of a place. Oh, do you have any roommates? I feel like roommates is more, more viable. Do you have any roommates or do you live alone? There's two of us. I live with my mother. Oh, you and your mother. How nice. We've been in the same one room apartment since I was a kid. I'm an adult now, and the room's too small for the two of us. That's why we're considering a bigger place. I get it. I live in a one room apartment too. It'd be strifling for two people to be cooped up in there. That's how it is with us, Kiryu san. Is there a good place for rent nearby? Would you let me know? Uh. Sure, I will. She lived with her mother since childhood. Maybe, just maybe, she could really could be the one. If I could get one more piece of evidence that points to Reika being Masumi's daughter. What did your mother do? Uh, your father's not around? Oh, my controller. Oh, it's okay. What did your mother do? They bo I mean, this is very direct, but this one could still lead to ask, like, be like, oh, my mother does this. She's been doing this since dad left. Like, that could be something. What does your mother do? What, your father's not around. Uh, I think probably way too hard on these choices. <laughs> Indirect enough, but still relevant? Yeah, I guess so. I guess redacted, you got me on that one. I'm not. I'm, he, and the, the game tells me this is weird. Come on. 
I'm not sure I should even be asking this, but I take it your father's not around? My father? To be honest, I don't remember him very well. You don't? Nope. My parents divorced when I was still small. My mother let him, left him and took me with her. I never saw my father since. Now, I can't even remember what he looked like. What caused their divorce? I think my father's business failed. I heard he was in a lot of debt, too. They divorced over her father's debt. That matches Mizumi's story. How long ago was that? How old are you? Mm, I was five at the time, so I think 15 years ago. Five years old, 15 years ago! It's all adding up! It was all correct from the start! It's, it's, her, it's his daughter! Kiryu san, why are you asking me these things? Let's lighten up the mood. Reka, there's someone I want you to meet. Huh? Uh. Who? Your father. <laughs> Whips it up! Your father. My, my father? But, but how? Imagine she, she thinks that Cutie is her dad. Would you come with me? Just trust me. Uh, okay. Hi, hi, Damascus. Good to see you. father's really here in Kamurocho? Uh. Uh. <laughs> he's... He's been hoping to see you for a long time. So, where is he? He should be somewhere around here... There he is! Oi. Hey, I brought your daughter. Kyushu's... Is my... My daughter really here? I forgot his voice already. Yes. Let her see your face. A father? I can't. I can't see my daughter. What? I'm so ashamed to face her. I'm sorry, you son. After I asked you to help me, and you even brought my daughter to me, I can't. Father, it's okay. It doesn't matter anymore. Please, look at me. Dot, dot, dot. I don't remember very much, but let's talk like we used to when I was little. Rekka had to beg to leave the club for this. You owe it to her at least to let her get a good look at you. Cure you, son. I was refusing to face reality again. It's just like 15 years ago when I turned a blind eye to my business doom, sank into death, and paid it for with paid for it with my family but i'm not going to run anymore oh wait wrong voice i think right it was still him talking i'm not going to run anymore i'm going to face reality i'm going to see my daughter hello natsumi wrong huh uh who's who's natsumi nani Nani? Is it Kiri also 20? I don't know. I haven't been told his age yet, Takama. Um, you're Natsumi, aren't you? My daughter? No, I'm Rika. Pardon? Isn't Rika just a stage name you used at the club? Uh, no, it's my real name. I didn't want to put on a false front, even for work. Wait. <laughs> When you? So that means you're not my daughter, but a total, a total stranger. <sighs> dot 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 dot. Kiri is like, why does this keep happening to me? I didn't sign up for this. <laughs> Our backstories are so similar, Misumi-san. It's almost like fate or something that we meet. Right? Strange, but true. Rika chan, you look just like my daughter. I see her in you. What she looked like when she was five isn't anything to go on, though, Misumi san. You're so silly. I couldn't find my own daughter, but I got to know you, Rika chan. This is even better. Boy. Hey, oh no! <laughs> I got played, didn't I? Oh, no. The wheel, 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 wheel,
Is this what you wanted? No. No, where is cutie son? What's life if you can't enjoy it? Uh huh. Well, this is for the trouble I put you through. I got goddess of children amulet. Oh, waiter, bring me the most expensive drink you have to make a ton over here. Yay, thank you, Misumi-san. Oh, stop it. I forget you to call me anything so formal as Misumi-san. Jerry, call me Jerry. Ah! <laughs> oh, I'll call you whatever you like, Daddy. Whoa, say that again, please. Once more. There's even an emoji. <laughs> My eyes twitching. You're both. Both. You and me both. Waiter, bring us a fruit platter. Quick. Uh? There's more than one kind of daddy, I guess. You just go home. Go home. Go home. <laughs> I just want to go home. I, uh, oh. I had to experience that. I had to experience that. Wait, 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 wait. I was walking this way to find more quests. And everyone lived happily ever after. I guess cute you got paid. Is that what matters in the end? Oh, come on, guys. I was letting you walk by. I guess I have to kill you all. Oh, let's bring him over by the car. I want to do some pictures on the car. Come, here. Come, here. Come, here. Come by the car. Yeah, no! That's being too greedy. Oh, I'm being too greedy. I want to do stuff by the car. I gotta get them knocked. Oh, no. How do I get them to do that? Get the finishers by the car. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Ah, not like that. <laughs> Maybe? No. I'll just step on him. Kiryu is... I think he just hides his, uh... Lack of innocence well. There's always, like, every corner. Somebody did a help. You want to get bruised, boy? I just want some money for the upgrade. Can I grab this bike? Yes, I can. Oh, AOE damage. Can't be stopped by really. Die. Ooh, and the wheel. Oh, I haven't seen the one with just the wheel of the bike. That was sick. Oh, beast mode, baby. Here is basically four. That mean he'd be like contactless? That means he would be like Sin from Guilty Gear. He's he's literally four years old. Cool. Mr. Shakedown? He was hanging out in the town square last I saw. I haven't seen him walk around this way at all. No, oh, I need more gambling. Cool. I haven't gambled before. What store is this? Darts. I don't think I've been in here yet. Shake me down. There are people left around. Do you like to play pool? Nope. Unless I want to in in completely embarrass myself. Would you like to play darts? Play solo. Don't need to know the rules. I'm going in. Which type of darts do you like to play with? What type of darts? Beginner. I don't know what these mean. I'm going straight down. Go straight down. Play the tutorial. Yes. 
In this game, the value of the sections you hit is uh, deducted from your score. Goals will reach zero. Both bullseye and double bullseye hits are worth 50 points. Going below zero is called busting. It becomes your opponent's turn if you bust, and your score goes back to what it was before the bust. First player to reach exactly zero before the end of the designated number of round wins. See the player reaches zero during the designated number of rounds, the one with the fewest points remaining. Okay. Uh, throw power. Okay. Aim, throw power, select dart, score display, show rules. Okay. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> I'm probably going to embarrass myself. Yikse. There's a cutscene for everything in this game. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, this is awkward. Ah! Huh. Ah! I goobered. Wait, do we not? I'm. I don't want high score, right? I want to subtract score, so I want to go not bullseye? Huh. Right, we want a lower score? Hmm. Well, I got a bullseye. Hmm. I'm confused. <laughs> this game is amazing. It's so deep, man. I really need to figure it out. Okay, so round three. Huh. Huh. <laughs> I'm just I'm just throwing these things, man. <laughs> Remove dart. I'm apparently I'm I'm, I'm winning though, right? <laughs> you want a lower score? <laughs> oh, I'm gaming. I'm gaming. <laughs> All right, last round. Let's see if I can get bullseye. Huh. Oh. Huh. Oh. Hmm. Ah! <laughs> I tried. It always like goes at an angle leftward from when you pull. Entertain yourself thirty times. I'm a game. I'm so good, guys. Apparently, I'm a darts master. You want bullseye until your scores can't handle 50 anymore. Got it. I hope you enjoyed the game. By the way, is this your first time in our bar? It is. Sometimes darts just the thing. <laughs> Indeed. Let me give you these. I got standard darts. They're slightly better than the run-of-the-mill house darts. And I can keep them? But of course, I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Wow. So I'm assuming I can get better darts to get better throw throwing ability. Also collectible. It's a lady. I still don't understand. Who are these women? Let's get a beer. Let's get a, Let's see how well I can I can do it when I um uh have a have a shot of whiskey. This is another example of popular Japanese whiskey. Spirits aged in sherry barrels at the Yamazaki Distillery are blended with carefully selected malts and grains. Is this a real alcohol? This yields a bright aroma and sweet fullness in the mouth. Is this just an advertisement? A lot of people call it Daharma because the bottle is round shaped like a Daharma doll. Is this all just an advertisement when I drink booze? Kiryu, if this gets you, if one shot, one drink gets you wasted, you are a little, little weak boy. I wish. All right, now we're going to play darts again. We're going to see how this goes. Play solo. All right, let, let's try intermediate. We'll do this one again. We'll do we'll do that, and we'll do we'll do these darts. Let's see what happens now. Five hundred and one points. I'm assuming. <laughs> Yikes. Hmm. Hmm. 
Oh, that was bad. <laughs> These darts are so much better. And, and the, the, the alcohol is affecting me. <laughs> the alcohol is affecting me. <laughs> they didn't implement that. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Here to you, you're doing terrible. <laughs> nice done. Never mind, I'm doing great. Oh, that sucked. I have no idea either, Redacted. I don't know the rules of this. I'm just throwing a dart. I'm hoping it sticks and I get some points. Oh, that went a lot, a lot better than last time. I think he's cheating. I don't trust this man. My aim just doesn't work. I lost. It doesn't work. I'm too intoxicated. No, Kiryu. Wait, wait. There's more rounds. I forgot we did more rounds. All right, I got this. I got this. I got this. Okay, 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 okay. I'm getting the hang of it. He's almost, he's almost already out, dude. I'm going to lose. Oh, I'm so goober. <laughs> he, he only needs to throw it randomly in a couple spots. Oh, I'm mad. Brain prey was basically what I was doing. Uh... I think being actually intoxicated made that actually harder. I think it did make my hand like not throw where I was aiming. Well, that was fun. I don't want to play pool. I do not like pool. As a person. I don't know how it would be in the video game actually. Maybe I should. Okay. Are there any more side quests? Can I steal this motorcycle? Oh, you know what I haven't done yet? Let's check this out. I haven't done any training. Uh, can I get anything upgraded here? I have enough for one upgrade. Heat gauge, increase the battle, power you regulate attacks, and he can win aggravated rush style. I don't use rush very much to actually do that. Ooh. I want then a um, movement direction and press triangle. When you attack an enemy, hit rate drops over time. It will slowly rise over time when you are wounded. Mm, I don't know. I'll hold off for now. Let's do. Let's see. Can I do the training stuff? Mm -hmm. You got money and skills to do this. What? Uh, you got the cash. We have been slacking on your training. Not enough upgraded. Oh, do I need to do it with that the shrine? Is it not this? Is it at the shrine maybe? Or or am I uh, understanding this correctly? Out of my way, son! Uh-oh. Why don't I do another stop and search? Yeah, you can look at my sushi. Hmm. It's about as safe as it gets. It doesn't look like you carry anything dangerous here. Take it back. Your cooperation is appreciated, kitty son. Why did you join the police anyway? Huh? That was out of the blue? You want to know why I became a police officer? Well, I just always see you here questioning people. It made me wonder if stop and searches are the whole reason you signed up to be on the force. I, uh, 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 what? Is it a touchy subject? Actually, I'm just ashamed to admit it, but stop and searches are the only thing I'm good for. I can't do anything else. Huh? What's that mean? When I joined the force, they partnered me with a senior officer. We, he was great at what he did, but really popular with the other officers. He had my back right from the beginning. Pretty much the ideal cop. Just like the ones you see on TV. I don't want to see. Ah. That, that, that. But then one day, 
we stopped in to break up a fight between some drunks. When I pulled them apart, one of them attacked me from behind. My partner moved to protect me, but he got stabbed instead. It must have hit an artery. Blood was gushing everywhere, and he didn't make it. He had my back until the end, too. <sighs> Ever since, I've been scared to death to real police work. No matter the task, I just end up getting real nervous. Now the others in my department just see me as dead weight. I try to stay out of their way when I can, but I spend my days out here doing stop and searches. Questioning people and searching their belongings is the only thing I have. That's all I could do. I'm sorry, I, 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 I rambled, I'm sorry. Thank you for your help. Mm. He's clearly down in the dumps. I guess I opened up an old wound. Way to go, Kiryu! Man, why you at? Why you like this? Yeah, he, you can look at my stupid. Yeah, uh, say that on your next date, guys. Oh, he died. All right, I need to try out, uh... Well, let me kill this man first. I mean, brutally injure this man. I miss dancing. I do kind of miss the dancing on on my They take so little damage. Oh, I five minute three stand. I killed him. Oh, man. You're right. I had to. I had to correct myself. Don't worry. I had it. Die. Check the ability wheel and see numbered nodes? What does that mean? On my... On here? What do you mean the numbered nodes? to check for side quests. I feel like I've been pretty a pretty big loop around. Uh Should I check on my real estate and then go do the I'll do the story quest? Yeah. Amasi, you you do not have a supply of coupons. You absolute liar. Do not Tyler like that. That's just, that's just me. Ow. Oh, he's fine though. Don't worry, he's fine. Oh, he's still knocking me down. I was spamming eggs. I like the music in this. In, in the brawler stance a lot. Die. You trade it with Miho? Okay. Yeah, I, like I would believe that. I'll hook you up with some coupons. Why? So, Tyler, don't give this man your coupons. You work so hard for those coupons. Also, random cutscene. Uh. Where's the producer? If he doesn't show up for the location shoot today, we're screwed. Well, he had a ar huge argument with the director at the last shoot. Remember, he's probably still burnt butthurt. Yeah, our director's something else. He wouldn't budge an inch, even when it means butt heads with the producer. I heard a lot of the crew can't deal with him either. Maybe it's, it'll be a strike. Well, whatever the reason, if we try to shoot on location without a producer, the director's going to be really boiled over. Uh, Maybe we can find someone who can stand in for him? Uh, sure, uh, someone can stay cool and calm while taking on the crap our director dishes out. Uh, we need a guy with the aura of toughness. A guy who can command respect just by being in the room. I guess guys like that are a dime a dozen, huh? Uh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Not like a guy who could do this is gonna just waltz down the street uh, at us. Huh? The pull Demeter. 
an aura of unstationable authority. Unassailable authority, not insatiable. That's our man. The poster child for a producer just walked out onto the scene into our lives. Eh? Eh? Oh, no. oh, wait, please. Wait. I'll save you. I mean, sir. You with that cool aura and magnificent voice. Oh. Yes, yes. I meant you. May I have a minute? We're a production crew for a TV show. What would a television crew want from me? Eh. Well, we're going to be doing a sh uh, shooting on a short segment. At a restaurant here in town for a gourmet food program. But we're down a man. We're desperate. Will you help us? Nani. Nani. How would someone who doesn't know the first thing about show business be useful to you? Yeah. No, 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 no. With an aura with th that's that magnificent, we don't have to do anything but stand there and look authoritative. Ooh. Authoritative. Well, I, I can't see. Your aura is so bright. It's dazzling. This reeks of BS. No, on, honestly, we're trying to p not, we're not trying to pull your leg. We're deadly sincere about this. We'll do all the heavy list. list. Well, actually, we may ask you to move things to help with some of the simple tasks, but. Helping out a TV show, huh? I guess that's something everyone gets to, ex not something everyone gets to experience. Please, please, it has to be you. No one can help, can help us. They aren't kidding about being desperate. Should I help? Yeah, what cute are you on TV? Fine, I'll help out. If it's not going to take too long. <laughs> That's great. Thank you very much. Oh, my name is Morse. I'm the director's assistant, and this is Kawaguchi, our cameraman. Hi, I'm Kawaguchi. Delightful to meet you. Uh. I'm Kiryu. Good to meet you. So, what am I supposed to do? Eh. Well, the show's producer is supposed to be here, but something came up last minute. He can't make it. So, we need to stay, you to stand in for him, Kiryu san. Nani? Wait, what? I don't know what a producer does, but isn't that a pretty important role? <laughs> <laughs> no, wait, you might think that. But a producer really doesn't act all high and mighty. It's a total fluff job. Is that it? I'd have no idea what I'm doing, though. People will know I'm faking it, won't they? Don't to worry. Once you get into some clothes with a more executive style, you'll totally pass for a producer. You mean producers have a particular look? Sure, they do. Now let's get you looking like a big shot. Uh-oh, this is not going to be great. Oh no! The sweater! <laughs> it's like he's gonna cry! Guys, do producers seriously dress like this? <laughs> Absolutely! You're a picture perfect producer! Isn't that right, Kawaguchi san? Hi! Hi! Uh, okay. So, what am I supposed to do? Well, our director is on the way. All we need you to do is be with him and keep us with up with his demand. So he can be a kind of a diva, and he says some weird stuff. But just try to set him off. Try not to set him off, and you'll do. You'll be fine. Mm. I'm having second thoughts here, but I'll see what I can do. How much you get me into that outfit? A lot. Uh. A lot. A lot. <laughs> he should be here any minute now. Oh. oh, the director's here. Here he comes. Cutie, you son, you're up. Try to act natural. Uh. Act natural. Got it. Yeah, man. Got it. Capiche. On it. <laughs> Just blazed out of his mind. <laughs> Ciao, lovelies. Good morning. Morishan! Good Morgan, baby! Uh, good Morgan to you. Don't ever change, Morichan. I'm counting on you today. Bling, bling, ka -ching, baby! Uh -huh. Oi. What in blazes? Where's our intrepid producer? Where is my Lita-chan? Sorry, 
Lita Chan. Girl didn't stick this morning. Was that capital I? Ida. Kiryu san here will be standing in for him today. Uh -huh. Kiryu, never heard of him. He's the real deal. He the real deal, baby? Hi. Yeah, of course. Kiryu san does a lot of work on location overseas. This is his first domestic shoot in a while, so he's probably why you don't recognize him. Very well then. That's la vie. <laughs> <laughs> don't care who you are. When you're on location with me, everyone has to pull their weight. Capi? Dot, dot, dot. Kiryu san, this is our director. Papi. Papi lon kato san. Uh. I'm Kiryu. Good to meet you. Hmm. Uh. He's stiff, he's stiff. You drag this guy out of the river, boy? I guess that what they say is true. People in television business do seem to be pretty shallow. This guy's irritating, but I better play along so he doesn't get suspicious. Uh -huh. There's a problem, cutie. If you can't return a simple greeting, your history in the biz lab. Figures a proper greeting is important to everyone to walk alive. What should I do? Observe etiquette, get goofy, discourage disrespect. Ooh, can I be mean? I kind of want Kitty to be mean. I don't like this guy. Discourage disrespect. Observe etiquette, get goofy. I kind of want to get. Oh, but I could get goofy. Oh, I don't know. Up to me. Oh, but I want to be a silly little guy. Uh, discourage disrespect. Observe etiquette. Discourage disrespect. Starting out right is important. Have to make sure I don't get disrespected. Dot dot dot. <laughs> huh? I'm Kazama Kiryu, and I'm the producer signing your paycheck, pal. Don't disappoint me today. Kiryu, uh, Kiryu, ta, ra, 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 ra. Um, how, how about uh, giving me a little space here? He won't look at me in the eye. Did I screw this up? <laughs> He's so scared. Oi. So anyway, where's the babbling bit of the window dressing? She's on deck for our dining report. <laughs> window dressing. Is that TV jargon? <laughs> yeah, about that. A reporter, Nagasawa-san, is running a little late. Uh? Uh? Then why the heck are we here? If it was your job to lock down the talent, you did that, didn't you? Sorry, I forget to I forgot to get her schedule in time. She's on her way right now. You incompetent imbecile. If we go over on time, we'll be screwing over the restaurant. You're a nice guy, Mori, but this stuff doesn't cut the mustard. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. This director. What a change from a cheesy goofball a few seconds ago. Guy's got one short fuse. Oh, uh, here she comes. Sorry, I'm, I'm sorry I'm late. No problemo, baby doll. We were patient as pie. <laughs> Ooh la la, don't you look ravishing today. <laughs> uh, Kato-san, don't be silly. Okay, gang, let's get this party started. Si la vos plate. I hope I said that right. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm going for, Raymond. Top 15 ways that you can... Order a Big Mac. <laughs> and all, that's the whole point. Fantastico. To your marks, everyone. Let's roll. Oi. Mon Dieu. What the hell is this? Where's the... Erasable. Oh, sorry. We'll, we'll get it. Sorry, kiryu -san. can you grab the erasable from the table there and bring it over? Erasable, I can check out what's on the table. That's a start. Sure, hold on. Oh, no. There are some pretty random things on this table. Which one do I take? Erasable, I'm assuming, sounds like... 
with the prop. Eraser, right? I don't... I don't... I feel like I'm gonna get tricked. I'm assuming it's the little eraser, but I feel like I'm gonna get tricked. Is it food because you eat the food? I mean, that would make sense because they're eating at the table. This will be on the test. Uh, food. I'm gonna say food because I'm assuming they're at the table, they're eating, they gotta have the vision, the, the view. The erasable, <laughs> I'm, I'm probably very wrong. The erasable is this. Oi. Hey, I bought the erasable. Thanks, cutie, your son. Then on the table, would you? Got it. Look at that <laughs> texture. Oh, that looks tasty. Doesn't it? I want you to savor it now. Let it linger on your luscious lips. This shot will be my tour de force. I don't like this man. He's creepy. Thanks. Sorry for making you bring it over, cutie son. Wait, I was correct, though. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about it. But boy, cutie son, I'm so glad you figured out erasable is what our crew calls consumable props, like food. Uh. Yeah, I figure that food is erasable when it's eaten. Erased when it's eaten. Brilliant. This shoot's going smoothly thanks to you. I managed to be useful. Somehow. Ah! <laughs> oh, wow! This looks delicious! There's so much, but it looks so tasty. I could eat it all in one sitting. Guys, can we get a panorama shot? Block, block the whole camera? Yeah, get a shot of us taking a shot. Yeah, perfect. Good, the shoot's going along smoothly. Pardon me, cutie you, John! But we have still life that... Er Wait, but we have to still life that erasable leader. So would you be a doll and grocer it for me? Uh, sure. Grocer the erasable? What does that mean? These all don't make sense. The, these two don't make sense. This has to be it, right? Because she's eating it. They need to make it look more full. So turn it so it looks at the camera like there's still more food. That's what it sounds like to me. The other two don't sound logical at all. Uh, grocery, huh? I got this. <laughs> That's a great looking grocer job if I do say so myself. Oi. Hey, I grocered it. Brilliant! Thank you, Kiryu John! Let's take a look! <laughs> Magnifique! The erasable is angled like a grocer's display! Oh, that's what they meant by it. Dude, I thought it was something completely different. I thought it was to keep it like how they lie about the burgers, you know, the burgers and commercials, how they just put like all the toppings to one side of the burger for one good shot. I thought that's what we were doing. When you grocer a prop, it means to tilt it at an angle, like how a grocer displays produce on the shelf. It's easier to film still life that way, but you knew that, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Managed to get it right. I'm a genius. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho, indeed, Zero. Bow, 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 bow. Thank you for the wonderful meal. It was delicious. Shoot's almost done. Sorry, Kiryu san. Can I get you to jeer these props? It's about time to strike the set. Daddy. What does jeer the props strike the set mean? Taunt the dishes, remove the. None of. Why is it always something so silly? It's too silly. Every single one have been two silly options and then one real sounding option. I got this. Mm. 
Thank you, Kiryu san. I'm glad you knew, you knew what jeering means, putting the props away when you strike the set. It's obvious. This way we can clear out as soon as the filming's done. That's smart thinking, Kiryu san. You're looking ahead to whatever needs doing. I'll hail the world's best producer. <laughs> yeah, right. No, seriously, you're really helping us out. Looks like I got that right. Let's go. I'm passing the test. I wonder if the only thing that I failed on the test was being a jerk. You don't taunt your dishes. I do when I'm putting the food on the plate. I'm like, take that. Yeah, have the spaghetti. But I'm not going to do it when the plate's empty. This just seems kind of rude. There's like no, no tension there. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. That's a wrap. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Number 15. Best popsicle stand. Shoots over, I guess. I kind of want Nightmare. That does sound like one of them could be a, a pickup line. You're right. Kiryu san, you saved us. You knew showbiz lingo like a pro. <laughs> No problem. I had fun with it. That was something else. It's rare to see a producer who could take charge of a location like you. Please accept our thanks. I got a magnet necklace. What is that? What? What's the point? You have all the makings of a great producer, Kiryu son. We would love to have you back anytime. What? <laughs> What's going on here? Producer. Either. Did the shoot go down okay without a real crew? Mm -hmm. The producer. Uh. What the devil? Why would you even bother showing up? <laughs> uh huh. You need it on a teleprompter? We're here to beat some manners into you. This is for working us like slaves late into the night. Who the hell do you think you are? We like to broadcast it because we love television. But thanks to you, we don't have the time to go home and watch TV. There's no way to live. What can I say? It takes blood, sweat, and tears to make a TV show. Fortified, gentlemen. Big talk as always, director. Who made you so important that you can treat the producer like this? Huh? I've had it with you. That's why we boycotted the shoot today. We're on strike. Boycotted? More like your per personal drama getting in the way of work. You call yourselves professionals? Yep. Oh, wait, the other dude. Yep, all you want. This is the last time we'll ever see you. So let's end this show on a happy note for us. Ow! Oh my god, what, 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 do, we, what do we do? I got this. Huh? Uh, cute you, son. Boy. Hey, hold it. Huh? Hey, Peter. <laughs> huh. Who the hell are you? The name's cute you. I'm the producer here. I can't have people harassing my crew. Cutie you, John. I. Wait. Uh -uh. Wait, you're my replacement? You just doubled my fun. I'll show you how irreplaceable I truly am. Come on, boys. We'll deal with this faker first. All right, Shadow. Faker. All right, I gotta take on the guy with the plywood first. Oh, there's two of them with some wood. Oh, let's go some beast mode. Oh, invisibility frame. Hold on, let me just, uh... Oh, no! Kitty, you fell down. Hey, come here, idiot. No, 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 no. There we go. Oh, oh he tripped me. Dude, went for the low. Ah, idiot. Problem here. Uh, dude, you know what? <laughs> He's swinging at nothing. He's coming right for me. Oh! Man, 360. Oh, got him in the back. I know, right? Do you see how 
how big Kiryu is compared to these dudes? Did they pull this guy off a bodybuilding show? Forget this. Kiryu san, are you all right? Uh. Uh, yeah, thanks a million, Kiryu chan. <laughs> hey, the least an amateur like me can do. So you were faking after all, Kiryu chan. You knew. <laughs> I'm no fool. I knew something was off the moment we met. You were a fish out of the water from... Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't fool a pro after all. But if you knew, why didn't you get rid of me right away? Because, Kiryu Jun, you did the best you could with such a passion, despite not knowing a damn thing. TV is not a gentle mistress. A single minute or even a second of footage can take dozens of hundreds of hours of hard work. The struggle is, as we say, real. The challenge demands an incredible level of precision, experience, and skill. But there's something even more important than those, and that's one of me. It's passion. Passion. I believe TV gives viewers hopes and dreams. There are people out there who can be inspired by TV and change their jobs or even their way of life. I think. TV is a medium that has the power to change people's lives for the better. You might be right about that. No, he's not. Uh. Most deaf. That's why we make programs with passion, no matter how hellish the process may feel. As creators, we are the dream weavers, and it's our duty to pass those dreams onto others. I do agree with that. You're quite the uh, director. You know what? You know that? <laughs> <laughs> Pinch posh. I'm just an overbearing loser who can't even hang onto a solid crew. I want to bring the same passion I have into my work, in my work out in them, but I never seem to get through to them. Da da da. Yeah. Director Kato, what you just said that motivated me to the core. We have to lot. We have a lot of growing up to do. I want to do more. I want to make better programs, and I want to create shows that bring people joy and inspiration. Hey. I want to channel our passion into our in film. So please, we want to keep us on. Keep. Want us. Uh, we want to keep on us like you do. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. You, you guys! <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you got through to them, don't you think? They get your old fashioned sense of passion. Kiryu chan, thank you. Honestly, you truly are a great producer! So you won't stop giving us hopes and dreams, right? Uh. On contraire, mon frere, frere, we'll show you dreams you've yet to see, even see in your mind's eye. Okay, boy, a production meeting. Let's drill down a plan for some better shows. Uh. What? We just wrapped. Have mercy. <laughs> uh, ha, ha, ha. My game's breaking. Oh, and then we fade looking up into the sky once again. Oh, what it is to be a man. What the heck does from the top mean? Oh, from the top, uh, from the top rope, QDU. It's when you climb on the top rope and you jump off. You, that, you, don't worry. You'll see it eventually. Influencers even, maybe. Yeah. Do they kiss now? What? The boys? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mm, water. Wawa. Make sure you guys drink Wawa, by the way. Hydrate. Take care of yourselves. Man, that makes me wonder, how many other side quests am I missing? I'm probably passed by, like, eight of them. You know, you would absolutely yeah. love pro wrestling. He would sit there and think, that's rad. There's no way he wouldn't. Oh, bro, 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 calm down. I just got out of that. Alright, 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 enough of that. I gotta run around the block. Bro, let me play the video game. I need an object. I need something to hit them with. Doria! 
Rolling time. Oh, I love drop kicking people! Me. We're not playing Tekken. Mm. See that money going up? That's my favorite. Oh, I fell down. Oh, he didn't die. Oh, now he's dead. Well, it looks like Kiryu needs to go have a late night bite to eat. I think we gotta go find ourselves a rescue wrong. I should probably save. Too. I haven't done that in a minute. Save. Man, it's exciting though, thinking that eventually I'm gonna be able to swap between the two characters whenever I want. I like that thought. No, I need to go eat a yummy. I need food. Where's the restaurant? Stop. Oi. I'm busy. I'm busy. He's hungry. I can't believe you can run out of, run out of energy. I want to know when the two are going to meet up as well. That's the one thing I'm like the most hyped for is figuring out when I'm actually going to be able to have Kiryu meet Majima. That's the one thing I'm waiting for. What is this? I haven't been in here yet. I don't think I've been in here yet. Oh, it's like, old, it's like a classic diner. Let's order. What do we have here today? Oh, we have been in here. We got some beef bowls. Oh, they don't have very much. They don't heal me very much. We got to go have a bigger meal. I'm sorry, sir. Kitty is very hungry. That Tommy's rumbling. Uh, oh. All right, let's see what we got over here. Soba. Ooh, they can get some noodles. This place, uh, older client. No, what should I do? Yes. I I just walked by a building, so I bought it. Didn't even think about it. It was there. I gave it my money. Uh, let's see. Ooh. None of these heal me very, they, none of these heal me all the way. Dang it. Yum. Oh, I want some. I look so good. I want yummy. Is this where my uh, real estate place is? I should probably check on it, huh? Oh no, that's old man. That's not that's old man. I can't do anything yet, right? Hey, oh, you can order boy. one more than one foy. One one foy, one food. He said boy, oh, so I read that. Uh, I haven't upgraded your abilities enough to learn new technique. Upgrade your brawl style abilities under. Oh, okay. <laughs> so it is through that skill menu. Got it. The leprechaun dress. Uh, so let's see. Bar frequented by Nishiki. Oh, is that where we were? Can I go hang out with Nishiki? I want to hang out with Nishiki. Oh, they're both in here. Hey, boys. You still look like trash. They're still fighting. The two are still fighting. Do more karaoke with me, brother. You really think you'll be okay on your own from here on out? If anything happens, you tell me right away. Oh, and they were roommates. <laughs> Ignore me. Uh, oh, wait, it's over here that doesn't get safe. Yeah, because the car's here. I remember the car. Let me in! Singing time? Oh, I would love to do some karaoke. Oh, I'm back in here. Hmm? What's this music? And they were roommates. Did Marina leave the radio on? Oh, that girl. Mm -hmm. 
How am I supposed to turn? How am I supposed to turn this thing off? Is this the off button? Oh, tell me he made it blast. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! What's this? I guess I changed the channel on the radio. <laughs> Reading off their postcards. Okay. Dolce! Dolce postcard? Okay. This guy is cheesy as it gets. I need to turn this off before he gets in my head. This featured postcards from our listener, the Thinking Driver Side. Uh, I listen to your show all the time. Hello to you too, and thanks. I have a girlfriend I adore, but this morning at breakfast we got in a huge fight. That does sound like a complete part of anyone's morning now, does it? Ha ha ha! The argument was over what kind of condiment to put on a sunny side up egg. Why would anyone argue about something so stupid? Hi, <laughs> hi. Kitty, you, I'm on your side. Also, this is how he gets wrapped up. Hold on, he's stuck. <laughs> I use soy sauce like any self-respecting Japanese man, but she used ton tonkatsu sauce. Can you believe that? Well, everyone has their preferences. Yeah, yeah. Since then, we haven't exchanged a single word. Some things are important enough to take a stand on. Maybe so, but some things aren't so important either. P.S. What do you put on your eggs, Kamiya-san? <laughs> I think driver son, you're making a monstrous boo-boo fighting the girl over something like that. Think you need to apologize for being so saucy. Whoa! By the way, I put ketchup on my fried eggs. What's the deal with this radio show? They're actually read stories that insane on air? Congratulations! Oh, would you look at this? There's a third postcard we've read on air. That's the third postcard we've read on air from the thinking driver son. Congratulations! I think you driver's son will have a fabulous prize heading your way. I'm not saying what, but it's worth a cool million yen. Nani. What? A million yen? Uh. Oh, it's time already. Too bad, too sad. But that's our show for today, folks. See you next All right, time. then. Make sure to tune in again. Goodbye and see you next time. What in the world is going on? If they read three of your postcards on air, you win something worth a million yen? Makes you rethink the value of things. I mean, a postcard about fried eggs got used on the show. Maybe you know, I could write something. Oh, Mr. President, you're here. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Where were you? You left the radio on. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I went out to buy some office supplies, like pens, paper clips, and parts cards. Nani. Postcards? Why postcards? Mm -hmm. well, why? Do you have something against postcards? Yeah. N no, I was just thinking I wanted some postcards. Ah, uh, okay. In that case, I'm going to put them in the desk drawer. Please feel free to use them. Got it. If there's anything I can write about, maybe I should try writing, <laughs> try sending in a postcard. Once you complete certain sub stories here, you can write about experience on a postcard. Access to the desk of it, uh, topics of the radio station. Maybe we'll get lucky in the end and up featured on the postcard. Oh, that's cool. Also, there's so much in this game. There is so much in this game. Random, random stuff just ha keeps happening. Very random radio show. I need to come up with a good pen name. What should it be? Judgment Kazi. I heart Nishiki. Oh, <laughs> I heart Nishiki. And they were roommates. Oh my god, you're so surprised. I'm surprised every time. I kind of like I heart Nishiki. <laughs> Because, uh, they're totally just besties. I heard Nishiki. Hmm. This is tough. I bet Nishiki would be good at coming up with something snappy sounding. Nishiki, Yama, Nishiki. Maybe just I heard Nishiki. Wait, what? I think I just creeped myself out. I need a different... <laughs> no! No! You didn't creep yourself out! You're just realizing what you, what you didn't realize yet, Kiryu. It's okay. It's okay. This is just game, yeah, this is game, prequel. This is game one, technically, but this is prequel. We still got so much more. I know, I can't believe they're roommates either, Tyler. Aw, oh, why can't I have, why can't I have, I heart Nishiki. 
He's fighting himself. He's really learning a lot these days, guys. Should base the name off something I like. Favorite food? Favorite color? Hmm, none of those strike a chord. Favorite song? Judgment? His favorite song is Judgment. That's it. Judgment Kazzy will do. Do I have the time to sit down and write a postcard for the radio show? Write a postcard. Sure. What are we going to write about? What are we going to write about, cutie? Are you going to write about your roommate? <laughs> what should I write about? I need to uh, be a topic uh, Dulce Camilla would want to read on air. <sighs> Becoming a daddy girlfriend with a secret. That one sounds pretty snappy. Let's do girlfriend with a secret. I'll write about shutting down the high school. No, I thought that was the dating the random girl. Oh, wait, no, that was Majima. That was Majima's story dating. Oh, no, that was Majima's story. I'm dumb. Now, let's see. <laughs> he's going. Guys, he's digging. He's going in it. He's going in it. There. Oi. Hey, man, can you mail this postcard for me? Hi. Oh, sure, of course. But uh, whatever you do, don't read it. Hi. Of course not. Why would I? Never, ever read it. Huh? Oh, for crying out loud. I won't. Bro is writing a such. He's writing his magnum opus at this point. We are getting chapter by chapter, every little piece. He's he, this instead of writing like a. A self-published biography, he's putting it all on postcards. And this is how you get to know Kiryu's story throughout throughout history. This is the only way you know. I, ho oh, I hope they choose my postcard. Better tune in to radio show next time to check it out. He works every kind of job without any kind of idea of what he's doing. Yes, that is absolutely correct. All right, I'm going to save real quick. All right, let's see. Can I send people out? Let's look how things are going. Pay out ready. Oh, wait. Uh, staff list. Ooh. Okay. Uh, so it's showing the area I can buy in, maybe? I don't have a manager. So, manager. That's guard. Wait, does it automatically do? I'm still confused on how to set things. Staff. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, okay, I got it. I got it. Go get me money, boys. Go get me some money. I still don't understand what I'm doing on that. Whoa, whoa, exclamation point. Who's here? Huh? Wait, do I gotta go back up in inside? Oh, he's on. It's showtime, I'm your host. Don't say Kamiya. As always, we kick off the show with shoutouts to our faithful listeners by reading off their postcards. Come on, read the postcard about from Judgment Cassie. Our postcards from our listener, Dorumros Drumstickson. Oh, it's time already? Too bad, too sad, but that's our show for today. Aww. His po my postcard didn't make the cut. Better luck next time. I can write again. Yup, time to write again. All right, which one are we gonna write this time? Um, what's a good one? Is we have a cue to read on air? Shrink a shrink wrap dream. How about we? We'll do the producer one. How about that? How about helping on the TV location shoot as a producer? Now let's see. Yeah, so far we they've just had exclamation points above their heads. So we've been able to see the people that uh uh are part of our Oi. our dealers our real estate dealership now. Can you mail this postcard for me? Of course. But whatever you do, don't read it, of course. Never ever read it. Of course. I hope he reads the postcard next time. Alright. 
Oh no, my internet. Am I okay? <coughs> Inter YouTube says error. Uh, am I doing okay? Uh oh. Uh oh. My internet says I'm perfectly fine, but YouTube says it's having problems. Uh oh. Oh no, this is not good. Oh. Seems fine, fine at the moment. I hope so. <clears throat> yeah, it says my internet says it's perfectly fine. Says YouTube. The YouTube's good now. Okay, YouTube still doesn't say that it's leveled out. So let let me. I'm gonna give it a second. Give it a second to to calm down. I guess I can look at my stuff. Uh, defense, bleed, firearm. Ooh, plus three defense. Oh, wow, that's really good. Are you actually saying I can't wait and save myself 30 bucks? Is that the new one? Is eight the new one? Okay, YouTube says we're balanced out, you know. Okay, so I'll keep going. I don't, I don't know what they are at this point. Yes? Ooh, I hope you have fun. He's on. How are you doing, everyone? It's Showtime. I'm your host, uh, Kamiya. There's no postcards. Postcards. Read it, read it from Judgment Kazi. Is a teenager forever? No! Why does this postcard not make the cut? Which ones do I gotta run out? The other one was about eggs. Becoming a daddy. Guy who got hooked up on clubs after searching for yep. Hooked on clubs after searching for his long lost daughter. Let's see. There. Don't Ooh. ever read it. Don't read it. Don't ever read it. It says on the not on the bottom of the postcard, PS, I love Mishiki. I hope it's not Shri Grab Dream. I hope not. Please don't read that on the air. I guess I'm just gonna keep going through the cycle of all of our postcard or our, our side stories until it uh. Until we run out. Oh, it was us! Cassie, it was Cassie! It was us! I pressed it. I, I did not expect it. Oh, it's time already. Too bad. Too sad. That's our time. All right, then. Make sure to tune in. Goodbye. See you next time. My postcard didn't make the cut. Oh, I thought it said it. I thought it said it. I went too fast. I ruined everything. I ruined everything. I was a lie. I thought I said Judge McCassie, but I read too fast. I'm a li I lied. I lied. I am a fool. I take the role of a silly clown. Uh... Let's do the Yo Yoko Michi Silvers. That was Kiryu being hopeful again. I think so too. Oi. Hi. Hi. Don't ever Hi. read it! Never read it! Alright. I should probably go actually do stuff now. I'm gonna go do the story mission, I think. And then move on. After that. Maybe come back. There's probably plenty more. I quest I missed, huh? Maybe you called? I called? Are you taking the role of a steely clown? I'm a fool. I know nothing. I take the role of a steely clown. But I won't turn my back on life. Oh, alright, so we're. Hey, I got places to be, boys. I'm busy. Uh, and 
then we go down this way. Big man! It's big man. Oh. All right, I go around big man. Can you figure out why he's doing anything anymore? I, I mean, to be fair, I'm the one piloting him, so I would I would assume. Maharaja. I guess I haven't been in these places yet. I should just check it out. I don't think I've been in here yet, right? Sure, what's going on in here? Oh, this is the disco! You'll need to pay entry fee to get back in. Yeah! Let's dance! Kitty, you, I wanna dance! I wanna dance! You can dance if you want to. Leave your friends behind. Friends don't dance. How do I dance? No, no friend of mine. We have done karaoke with Kiryu. Uh, karaoke was like in the tutorial, like the very first mission. And we did one more. I wouldn't mind doing another though. Want to show off some sweet moves on the dance floor? About the disco. Oh, what is this? Dance to the disco, press buttons to the rhythm of the song. Use up, down, left, right to move your character's avatar to the square with the next input icon. Then press the corresponding button that shows up in the frame overlapping square border. To move your avatar, you'll see the number of steps it takes. The more steps you take, the more points you will get for the correct input. So try to take as many steps as you can on your way to the next input icon. Squared mark is ready. Oh, this seems complicated. There's so many mini games in this game. In the upper middle of the screen in the, is the fever gauge. Press L1. Okay. When you're full to trigger dancing fever, a new screen with a series of button inputs uh, will appear, press them in the correct timing to boost your score. To charge the fever gauge, press the, the correct icons in the room. Okay. Ain't it Friday? It's, uh, Thursday. I had to check. I didn't remember. The voltage gauge at the upper right shows how impressed the audience is with your dancing. It directly affects the rating you get, so build up the score. A gauge that has four levels. Each level earns you another score towards your final dance rating. There is also a versus mode which you complete another dancer. Is that Nishiki? I want to dance versus Nishiki. Because they were roommates. I couldn't get this. It was complicated. Maybe a few years later, I should try it again. I'm about to find out if I hope I can understand. Which song do you want to put on for you? This one says easy, so we'll do We'll do easy while I figure out how to play this, alright? Here we go. All right. So I have to go to the square. My eyes. All right. That's what we read. Right. So move to the square and the after square within the frame overlapping square border. So you want to take as many steps as it says on the screen to get there. And you have until it fills up. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> I was like, how do I know how many steps I'm supposed to take? 
You just take as many as you can until the timer basically runs out on the square hitting the, the, the square of the button you press. So I understand now. I understand. I want to do it again. And I want to do it again. I'm the main character. Let's do another song. Queen of Passion. Here we go, guys. I gotta watch Kiwi. He's silly little guy again. Yeah, Kiwi. Almost overshot that. Oh no! Oh no, I'm too slow! I hate that he gets mad at me. with me okay it does it, it, it is kind of hard it is kind of hard to do but it is a rhythm game so there is probably like a nice way to try to get used to like the flow of it that was fun now what else can i do pretty sure those cutscenes are in-game cutscenes and you can mod the models to be in what so when i beat the game we got to come back around and i gotta i gotta be uh whoever i want to be I get, to, I get to do the the grooving as Spider-Man or whatever. All right, let's get out of here. I'm gonna go do the the story mission now, finally. And then we'll have to figure out some things. That was fun though. We get a lot, there's, there's a surprising amount of actually like really good music in this game and I really like it. And it kind of sucks because the soundtrack that's on uh, like YouTube and Spotify, like the official post and stuff, doesn't have a lot of the songs that I've heard in the game so far. Like it's it's only like 20 songs and and I, we've heard so many more than that. <gasps> All right, we're seeing the lot where the guy died. They didn't clean up the blood. Kitty. No one dies. Lies! That man was murdered! Hello, stranger. Tachibana. Oh, I told the boss to go hide. Kiri is a bad guy now, but yeah, he's here.警察が調べ尽くした現場です。もう真犯人に繋がるような証拠は残っていませんよ。わかっている。うちの情報網を使って、クゼを洗いました。もしクゼがあなたをはめた黒幕であれば、ここでの殺しのため殺しを。We understand that so far. あなたに殺しの濡れ衣を着せた黒幕は、おそらく癖じゃありません。何今、私が掴んでいる情報はここまでです。それはあなたにお伝えしようと思いました。Yeah, I can see that. 
うちの動きに気づくまでもう少し時間がかかると思っていましたがそれでも想定の範囲内ですその割に小田は淡くってたらな小田、yeah, さんにもまだ伝えてないことですが実は、What? この殻の一つの所有者を見つけましたえ分け合ってまだ接触はできていませんですがその人物を内側押さえ体の一つを手に入れれば当時組は我々に土地を売ってほしいと頭を下げることになるこの土地の価値はそれだけの力を生むんですですから桐生さん I mean, I've been learning the real estate world. I think I can do it. Just, I need a manager and an advisor. Muri na soldan de shoka. Kara no hitotsubo no mochi nushi wa. Itz o osae rare るんだ Ichi nichi kudasai. Tada shi. Tagon mo yo desu. He's gonna be able to do it one day. Tato e a i t e ga. Nishikiyama san ya. Kashiwagi san de atte. あんたを今、アワノに売り渡せば、俺は道島組に狙われずに済むんだがな。あなたがそういう人なら、私はこんなところに、のこのこ、ありがとうございます。明日連絡します。どうかそれまで、道島組から、生き延びてください。キリュウさん。You plan to just waltz past without a word you want through here? You gotta pay the toll. A shakedown. I feel bad for the guy, but I can't really afford to get involved right now. Boy. Play it, you mute or something, Blondie. If you don't want to get hurt, let's do some, let's do some cash already. <laughs> oh, if you insist, just be sure to pick it all up, hmm? Huh? Huzzah! Hmm? <laughs> Whoa, it's money! Whoa! Eh? I've never seen so much dough in one place! Huh? Whoa! Yeah! I have demands on the first one. I keep your grubby mitts on my job! Uh -huh. Shut up! Move your freaking legs! <laughs> oh, my, my! Peasants truly are a certain lot! <laughs> His face! <laughs> Oh, did you want some of my money as well? Yeah. Mm, no. Then I shall be on my merry way. Till next time, cheers! Oi. Wait, do you always throw wads of cash to just clear the road like that? But of course, why? At the point you cough up the money, it's no different from getting mugged. <laughs> oh, I suppose commoners just don't understand. Uh -huh. Excuse me? You see, when you just... Uh, not just wealthy, but obscenely rich. Physical cap uh, capital is just dust. It just accumulates. Gets in the way, really. That's loose change. I won't miss it. Go. On the other hand, having a precise time wasted by base ruffians like them is a serious loss. If I can buy that time back with coin, why, I'll pay as much as it takes. Buying time? Literally. Precisely so. Why not give it a try if you're curious? Yeah. Hmm. Give what a try. Let fly with a great whooping lot of wealth. Yeah. Oh, uh, oh no. I wouldn't. I'm just not that big of a rush, honestly. Mm hmm? Hmm? Truly, have you ever been out on a stroll and felt the other pedestrians were in your way? Not ever? Well, sure, I guess a few times. <laughs> oh, you see? Then give it a try right now. I'm sure you'll feel the thrill sitting those human hurdles scattering. Mm. Mm, sure. When I have that much cash to burn on a whim. Not to worry. I will be your financier this on one time. As a special gift, you need to focus only on enjoying the rush of flinging cash confetti. Okay. 
deal. You're uh, really going to pay for it. I'll give it a go. What is this? Press square while walking around the stadium to take a handful of your money and flee in the air. Anyone nearby will flash the cash and grab it. Keep in mind the next time you're in a hurry. Try using to attract the women behind you. Okay. <laughs> huh? Cash confetti. On narrow street and alleys, you'll find you often find a way completely blocked by punks eager for a fight. Walking around them simply is an option in these situations. Distracting them with a mountain of cash, however, they'll literally leap at the first chance to fill their pockets. Try it and save yourself a headache. So Get cuter, you learn to summon the poor. Wow, what a lesson to learn. I feel like a great guy. Simply strut past him. Okay. On my way. On the way. Be judiciously wasting money. You can buy your way out of mostly unnecessary conflicts. Keep in mind the next time you're in a hurry. Okay, so it's good to have for when there's time-gated stuff and I gotta rush to somewhere. I, I get the point. I get mm. the point. It's really magnificent money blasting for a moment. I completely forgot you were merely another plebeian. Mm. Mm, is that what, it, what being rich is like? Honestly, I can't say it feels very good to waste it like that. Perhaps. But aren't there times where you are far too hurried to be embroiled in the pretty petty squabbles of the underclass? That's... that's not... I... Okay, yeah. Right? Mm. Really? Whoever said time is money is an utter buffoon. Time is far more precious resource. It's finite. Fair enough. I can see a weird sort of logic in that. Then I made my case. Take my advice. If you ever in danger of being dragged in a meaningless fight, just let loose with a heaping help of legal tender. So you're clearly loaded. But how'd you earn all that cash? Mm. Oh, I take it you've caught a, caught a case of money fever, hmm? Maybe. I was thinking it'd be convenient if there was a quick way to make some extra money. Common sense tells me that's crazy to wish for, but I might as well ask. Oh, but there he is. Seriously? The very epitome of high risk, high reward. It's been my golden goose, and now I dine on diamond for a grass. It's been... Head for Theory Square. If you're truly a man of means, you'll find a way from there. What am I looking for? Oh, don't... You'll know when you see it. A paradise exclusively reserved for the upper echelons of wealth and taste. Though naturally, that isn't my only source of income. I have quite the diverse portfolio. So then, eh? I, uh, oh, should I say, we must put our capital to work in a certain system that gives rise to considerable profit. If you wish to hear more about us, that as well, drop by Vincent. You'll find me there most of the time. Vincent, got it. This has been the most stimulating use of my time. Ta-ta! You pleb? Says you! Tachibana uh, may have new intel tomorrow, but that doesn't mean everything will be done over then. Should tuck away as much cash as I can so I'm ready for whatever comes. He said I'd find a way to make big money at Theater Square. I was worth a look. Alright. Now I can buy weights and food though. Boom. I mean, the food part got me. Okay, let's check out what he was talking about. Flinging my cash all over the place, quick money. I'm assuming it's gambling. My first thought is it's gonna be gambling. That rich guy said I should go to Theater Square if I want to make big money. Hmm? Rich looking man. I've been waiting all day for this. Excuse me, my good man. Right this way, sir. Beyond the door. Enjoy your stay. What does he mean by that? Where does this door go? Oh, uh, 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 
got rejected. Uh, there's definitely something behind it. Sorry, pal. That's not opening to you. I saw you let a guy in. What's in there? <laughs> you think I'd come right out and say it? Well, let's just say it's a paradise for men. A place where dreams come true. A place where dreams come true. Yeah, a real life wonderland. Got your interest up. It does, uh, make me curious. Oh, I skipped a line. I am the disciple. Actually, I say who comes in. You want in, you gotta win my approval. Huh. Alright. So what do I need to do to impress you? This place is a paradise for the wealthy. If you don't have the bread, you can't afford the dessert. I have to see that you got enough cash to make a splash. Not only that, I want to see that you've got the balls to do it with style. You prove that to me, I'll let you win. You use your noggin and figure it out. Paradise for the wealthy. This is definitely the place that rich, crazy, that crazy rich guy was talking about. So I have to show this guy I have money to burn and the willingness to burn it. Uh, uh, uh. Cash to make a splash on that. Okay, figure it out. Okay, figure it out. Bizarre. Do I have to run around and throw cash around? Hey everyone! Money! Hey guys, uh, where's somebody that wants to beat my butt? Who wants to bully me? Here we go. Money! Don't worry about it, you're all my friends now! Woo! At him? Oh, okay. Hey, dude! Wee! What do you think you're doing? You lost your mind? <laughs> Just showing that I got cash to burn, and I'm not afraid to set it on fire. Well, I never thought I'd see a guy who literally tossed money onto the pavement. You gotta screw this. I like to cut your gym, but oh, no, no, you come in. Right this way. Good night, Damascus. Oh! Oh. What is this place? It's the official arena of the JCC Jap Japan Cat Fight Club. Sexy little vixen scrap it out in the arena filled with beauty and ugliness. The men bet big wages on the winner that one plays is about. Feast through the eyes is an exciting chance to jump on it one by making funny leg bets. Pleasure place for men, I call it, and that's what it is. Not exactly double. Uh, not entirely refined, but who cares? Not me. Oh, here. Take this back. It's yours. I got my money back. What's this? The cashew... Uh, the cashew burn. It was a real joy to watch it floating around, so I scooped it all back for you. You think I have fun in here, pal? Good luck to you. Uh, uh yeah. Why would you want to come here? Where is it? <laughs> Cat fights, huh? Never expected to find that going on in Kamurocho. What a gaudy place. But I bet I can make money here. Even with the wrist, it's worth a shot. Alright, I'll do it once. Stop with this camera! Please? Gulp! <laughs> How do you feel a rock, paper, scissors? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. But if I play it right, it feels like I could turn a hefty profit quick. Got a new way to make big butts, but I really need to get to sleep. Now rest up for tomorrow. Oh, whoa. Whoa, oh whoa. all right. So I'm gonna go up towards his home. And I'm gonna save. And then we'll do the cat fight tomorrow. Well, he said I gotta sleep first. So we're gonna get him to sleep and then we'll do the cat fight tomorrow. But I gotta wrap up here for tonight. So I'm gonna save. Oh, gorse! Oh, gorse, Maxie! Never would expect this! <laughs> Alright, uh, so I saved... Uh, I guess I'll just stop. I'll stop at the save point. Yeah, I'll stop here. No, I'm sorry! I know! 
like I said, things things should be going to a place where I'll be able to stream a little bit more soon, hopefully. So. I got lucky and made 20 mil. That's so many upgrades. I need that. I need that. I need to be able to have enough money to upgrade so I can start uh, getting all those um those lessons from my teachers, man. How else am I going to become big, strong boy? I tried and rage quit because it's B. Oh, I assume it's absolutely, completely, like, skewed. Like, I don't expect it to be able, like, act it's actually gambling. It's going to be rigged. The women are absolutely not actually fighting. It is rigged from the start. The game was rigged from the start. Try <laughs> Please just make sure you drink plenty of water, Raymond. All right. But I'm going to wrap up here, guys. Still got work tomorrow. Uh, so thank you, Mossy, Raymond, Redacted, Ezekiel, Tiger. Tire, you're a tire now. Tyler, you're a tire. Tyler. Uh, Grishtar, Ekibert, Nightmare, Mossy, Damascus, Tiberian, uh, Berserker, uh, Massive Legend, Zero, Dakama, uh, Nami, say hello. Raymond, of course. Probably missing somebody else. Who am I missing? Uh, Cloudy. Cloudy was here. Yeah, tire, 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 tire. Go get your tires changed. <laughs> uh, redacted, of course. Uh, probably more than I'm missing. You know the usual. Yell at me if I missed you. I apologize. And all the lurkers, everybody else. You know I still love you. Go tanks. Thank you. You have a good night too. Go tanks. All right, everyone, I'm heading to bed. Thank you for hanging out with me, and I will be back soon. Bye-bye, farewell, and have a good night. Bye.